Have you ever wondered if it's possible to open a joint trading account? To invest, do you need both a trading account and a DMAT account? Can you open a joint DMAT account? Are these constant questions that run through your mind every day? Then you've come to the correct place. If you are looking to invest in the Indian securities market, you need to open both a trading account and a DMAT account. Now what is a trading account? This account enables you to buy and sell market securities and execute share market trades. And a DMAT account is where you can hold these securities in an electronic form. You can open these accounts with the help of stock brokers. Let's dive into understanding how to open a trading account. So firstly, you can open a trading account both online and offline. If you are planning to open a trading account online, you need to visit the broker's website and apply and follow all the instructions. You will need to provide your contact details in the application form and submit it to the broker. If necessary, your broker will contact you and assist you. You will need to submit copies of your PAN card, your identity proof and address proof documents as per the official valid documents list and complete the KYC formalities. Following this, your broker will open your DMAT account and trading account in just a few minutes. If you are planning to open a trading account offline, you can visit the branch office or the office of the broker with your PAN card, your ID proof and your address proof documents. Now the question is, if you can open a trading account jointly? The answer is no. You can open a trading account only against a single name because every trading account is linked to the investor's PAN number. This PAN number is linked to the investor which allows the IT department to track the income and investment details and tax the liabilities of the investor. It also eliminates any confusion regarding tax liabilities. While as far as joint DMAT accounts are concerned, you can open a DMAT account jointly as well as individually. For DMAT accounts, there can be a maximum of three account holders. That is one primary holder and two joint holders. But remember, you can't open a joint DMAT account with a minor. So remember that you can't have a joint trading account, but you can have a joint DMAT account. Invest now and secure your future. Investments in securities market are subject to market risks. Read all related documents carefully before investing.